welcome back to my youtube channel i am christina kelvin in case you're coming across in case you're coming across my video for the very first time i film on faith motherhood parenting christian lifestyle from parents uh, from lagos from lagos nigeria please do well to join this growing family by pressing on the subscribe button and do well to press the bell beside it so that you get notified each time i drop a new video my last video on how to attract a god-fearing spouse series i spoke about how you yourself must be god-fearing you know in case you haven't seen that video i'll put the link uh, description box below or I'll, I'll put it up here so make sure you click on that video to watch in case you haven't seen the video so i spoke about how important it is for you to be god-fearing before you can attract a god-fearing spouse to yourself so today i will be talking about the importance of prayer yes one of the principles i gave on how to attract the godly on how to attract a god-fearing spouse is that you have to pray about it yes you know prayer is a means by which we communicate our intention to god and now that you've submitted your will your emotions your thoughts and everything about you to the governance of god then the most important thing for you to do to attract a god-fearing spouse to yourself is to pray about it girl you need to pray it's not too early neither is it too late for you to start praying about about having a god-fearing spouse i remember vividly that i started praying for my husband even before we met i mean i started praying about my marriage as an undergraduate student when i entered part one even then i did not even have a boyfriend i didn't even know the, i don't even i did not even have a picture of who this person is gonna be in my head but all what i have then was just loving god and all all what i just know to do then was just loving on god and in my place of loving on god i keep telling see scriptures make us to understand that we should ask and it shall be given seek and you shall find knock and the door shall be opened unto you so whatever you desire whatever you want whatever you you know you you care to have it's first of all important that you pray about it you ask the father about it and see our father is not a wicked god he's not a wicked father he will definitely give to you that which he know you desire it's not a crime for you to have specs and you know present those specifications before god but of course one of your topmost priority in this scenario is to attract is to find or is to have a god fearing spouse so of course table it before god tell it to god scripture also makes us to understand that he will find it a good wife or a good partner obtain it favor from the lord so it is of the lord that gives good partner and now that you are on the lord's side then use your weapon and that weapon is praying pray about it tell it to god god i want a man that will fear you i want a man that will submit his life to your leadership i want a man that will be a priest in the house i want a man see whatever you want in your mind tell it to god let god know make your desires of make your desire known to god about who you want in your mind so never feel like it's too much or probably you're asking god for something physical when you're asking about when you ask him to attract a god-fearing man to you he, origin he originated marriage so ask god and never feel like you're asking god for so much by this we've come to the end of this video and i know that you've learned one or two things if so do have to give me a massive thumbs up and i will see you in my next video bye for now.